it's all a matter of how much effort are we going to put into it. For me, I think the wrapping is almost more important than what's in there. I completely agree. I'm so glad you said that. I yeah. want people to focus on wrapping this season. When you put something in a beautiful package, it makes the gift that much more special. Yeah. Especially if people keep their gifts under a tree or they don't open them right away, then there's the anticipation, ooh, what's inside this beautiful box, exactly. right? Exactly. So I have some tricks for doing it, and then we're going to actually wrap a box. I'll show you how to do that like a pro. Okay, good stuff. All the right. first one? Let's start off with a bow. So any regular wrapping paper, that you do, it really looks best when you finish it with a gorgeous bow. Yeah, when you're choosing ribbon, I recommend something that has a wire in it because then you get to shape it into something really beautiful. You know, you can fluff it out and make this stand out like this so it has a lot of volume. And then to cut your ends, just fold this in half, take a sharp pair of scissors. Oh. You can cut it like this or you can cut it at an angle. Right. But that's really key too. Sometimes I'll even take scissors in the car and when I'm taking someone a gift, I'll cut the bow at the very end because you don't want it to fray at all. You want it to look oh really my gosh, sharp and perfect. You're a perfectionist. Oh, it, 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 That's it's great. all about the bow. Wow. So look for, you know, great unexpected details in your ribbon mm -hmm. and look for, you know, spend the money on a nice ribbon. You can use any regular paper, yes. but when you have a beautiful bow, it just takes your gift up to the next level. You can even use craft paper, right? Which exactly. is what you've done here. Yes. So I was using white wrapping paper and craft paper and just buying little accessories and a glue gun, you can make your gifts look so beautiful and so different. This is just a torn edge, so I wrapped it first in white, yeah. and then I took a torn edge of craft paper and wrapped it a second oh. time. And That's then, pretty. You know, just little things from the dollar store, just wrap it up, glue it on, and it yeah. looks beautiful. So this, too, I was using the Scotch Expressions tape. So this is your washi tape. Right. But you can take your paper, like you said, you know, craft paper or a plain wrapping paper. You know, it's not messy. Just tape it on. Yeah. You can either lay the paper flat and do it all across the paper first before you wrap, or you can wrap it up and then wrap and the then tape around. It around. It's so much fun. Look at that little Christmas tree, too. Oh, this is pretty. Yes. So made all out and of tape. And easy to do, all with the Scotch shape. Yeah, that yeah. is very easy to do. And I like this, too. I like this, the asymmetrical crosses going here. Yes. It's such a little thing, but I think it makes such a big difference. Yes. Beautiful. So, now, let's wrap. I'm going to get these out of the way because I want you to be hands-on and wrapping. Okay. So, are we going to have a wrap challenge? <laughs> we should, but I think I'll probably win. <laughs> I think we'll be honest. Too. I'll be honest. <laughs> I think she's right. Okay, so what you want to do first, when you're cutting out wrapping paper, I yeah. have some pre-cut for oh, you. Oh, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> you want to make sure that you're not using too much paper. So you want to actually take your box and roll it around and make sure that it fits. Make sure that you're not going to have too much excess. Yep. And you want the sides to come a little bit higher than halfway up the side. Oh, that is way that you, how you measure it? Yes, that way you won't have a little bit of extra peeking through. Yes. Okay. Now, let's talk about your tape. So you're not using just regular tape. No. Um, Scotch tape has magic tape. This one is gift wrap tape. They practically disappear into your package or double-sided, which is even better. Okay. So let's get started. The first thing you want to do, which is my little trick, you want to fold over your edge like that. And so, it's this so that I'll have those perfect, perfect exactly. edges, right? Exactly. You fold this over. Usually the gift is upside down. We'll mm -hmm. wrap this around and then We'll tape it in place. So again, you don't want to use just regular tape. So not just double-sided tape, no. Or do I use the double-sided tape? I would save the double-sided tape until save the end. It. So do you so get your daughter to be your tape holder? <laughs> exactly. That's just my, is, she loves that know, job. I, I wouldn't say this is a, a good one for kids because you want it to be perfect. So <laughs> I could use the, um, the double-sided tape here. I think you have that one. Oh, here, why don't you use the double-sided tape? Oh, so we don't want any of the tape to show. Exactly. And if you're really hardcore, yeah. you'll take this cream here and line it up over on the side. Oh, stop yeah, it. Yeah, so that you can't even see. <laughs> so what's really that important was, I want a having, gift from you this With season. having the perfect gift, it's really all about the creases. Yeah. So make sure everything folds in perfectly. It creases nice and creases flat. Yeah. Like this, nice and sharp. Use your fingers along. So along the edges, but even on the sides, you just want to get that perfect crease, and that's what will help your present look perfect. It's hard to do upside down. Now, okay, so I feel like this is good, but did you <laughs> Did you do yours like this? Look, I'm doing my I like, like this. to do that. Yeah, so down. But your creases aren't good. Oh, oh dear. Yeah. So, oh, I see what you're no, doing. What was I, I thinking? What was I thinking? Yeah, you really need to hold it in first. Okay, all right. Okay, Look, this is my creases are good now. 
<laughs> and then do it up, and we'll use we'll use the uh, the double sided tape to make oh, that nice and clear. It's a little bubbly, but it does the trick. It's not bad. Where it, Listen, if there's bigger. a ring in there, I don't care about the packaging anymore. <laughs> okay, like is it jewelry? 